The bruiser wait. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Birmingham, England. Weighing in at 205 pounds. The bruiser weight. Pete Dunn. Pete Dunn loves to twist his opponents up to bend their limbs in ways they shouldn't be bent. I get chills just thinking about it. And now you have the pleasure to call the action live here tonight. Congratulations, Sexton. Well, Pete Dunne has earned the right to have a reputation that precedes him as one of the most feared superstars in all of WWE. The icy stare of Pete Dunne is unsettling because you know he's about to hit you in the mouth. And his opponent, what the? Oh man, still not. The ambush fails. Yeah, good thing too. They need to get in the ring and the referee is going to call this off. These guys just are seeing red right now. Double underhook applied. He just cannot be caught. Great way to break down your opponent. Ooh. Missile drop kick finds its mark. How do you counter the bruiser weight? Someone who's so technically gifted between those ropes. I think we learned it best at NXT TakeOver New York when Dunn lost his championship. You just keep chopping and pounding the holy hell out of Pete Dunn. Obviously, not everyone's chops and strikes are going to be as powerful as that night, but this is still a solid plan of attack. You can bet that Pete Dunne is going to look to utilize his classic English mastery of submission holds and attacking an opponent's limbs. And we're here in Orlando, a breeding ground. Look at this. Oh, oh, diving moonsault. This match grinded him down a little. Yeah, but he's not breathing heavy yet. Oh, and a discus clothesline. Took their head off. He might have been waiting on that one. What a clothesline! Ouch! Uh-oh. Look at this! Power bomb! One. And done quickly! Kicks out! It's gonna take more than that. Uh-oh. What is going to happen here? Look at this handstand. Man. Into a headset. Things are about to pick up, guys. I love a good plot twist. The bruiserweight Pete Dunne is my kind of superstar. All he wants to do when he gets in the ring is win. And his particular method for winning is inflicting as much pain and punishment on his opponents as humanly possible in a good old-fashioned way. He's going for it. He's got it. Stuck that one in. Pete Dunn fell short tonight. Here's where his opponent took advantage. Here is your winner, Isaiah Scott. Well, that one was over before it even started. The bruiserweight Pete Dunne always has more than one plan, but in the end, none of them worked tonight. What a matchup that was. Truly incredible.